Hi, with the introduction of 5G and ORAN standards, one of the interfaces which has come up is O1. How does O1 interface fits in overall architecture of ORAN standards? And which, in, which are the RAN elements are getting exercised as part of the O1? And what is the management plane element which, are, which is consuming this O1? So let's talk about few of these details in the next moment. Before that, let me quickly introduce myself. My name is Yogendra and I am from Arna Network and I contribute to ORAN SMR solution in NAMCOP. So let's get started. So the very first one, uh, the system integrator and customers has, which is the protocol getting exercise as part of O1. So it is the NetConf protocol which is getting used underneath the O1. With this, the very next thing which comes in the mind is which are the two network elements which will get connected using the O1 spec or O1 interface. So after the disintegration of the RAN elements, now we have RU, DU and CU. So your DU and CU are the network elements which will be connected using the O1 interface by the SMO. So how does SMO uh, utilizes the O1 interface and connects the DU or CU or manages them. So, like I was mentioning, it is a NetConf protocol which is getting utilized. So, SMO act as your NetConf client and in the south you have the network elements like DU and CU which is going to act as a NetConf server. Once a connection is established from SMO to RAN elements, it is the data models which is getting exchanged which is represented through the YANG and the features of the NetConf protocol is being exercised. Essentially, your NetConf client should be able to view all the startup and the running configurations from the network element and as the operator should be able to enable more features once the connection is established between the SMO and the network functions. And these features would be pertaining to all F caps like fault, performance, trace management, or any of the slicing features. So, this is a very short summary on how the O1 interface is getting utilized by the SMO. If you have your DU or CU ready with the O1 interface implementation, you can go ahead and validate with any open source management plane element SMO. Uh, Arma has its own open source uh, implementation of SMO which is available in Azure Marketplace. One can validate that implementation and you can also reach us on our YouTube channel which uh, provides more details on the SMO and thanks for listening to us.